Today, we're going to be balancing the equation of Cl2O7 plus H2O, and that will yield HClO4. I already wrote out our little balancing chart that will help us greatly out here, as well as the elements that I see on both the left and the right sides. All we have to do is just start, you know, numbering how many we have in the beginning, and then we can get to balancing. Let's start with the left side first. For a chlorine, Cl, I see that I have a two here, so I have two chlorines. For the oxygen, I'm just gonna be careful. I have oxygen here and here on the left side of the yield sign. So I have to add them up. Literally, there's a plus sign here. So for the oxygen, I have seven plus one. There's no coefficient for this oxygen. That means there's a one. So seven plus one is a total of eight. So I'm gonna put an eight down here. And then for the hydrogen, I see that I have a two here. So I have two hydrogen. On the right side, for my chlorine, I just see that I have a CL here, no subscript, so that means one. So I'll put a one here. There are four oxygens, so I'm gonna put a four here. And then for the hydrogen, it's just lonely H, right? There's only one, so I'm gonna just put a one. And now I'm ready to balance. Pick the one that is easiest to balance by multiplication. Um, I'll start with the chlorine. I always go from the lower number to the higher number by multiplication. Two times what will get me to two? Yeah, two, right? One times two is two. I think I said two times what, but one, one times what, right? One times two. And that number that you stated is the coefficient of the compound in which you have that element. So I'm gonna put a two here. But now when you put a coefficient, you have to be fair. You have to get all of the elements a different number. Okay, so the H, the Cl, and the O are going to change. Now you have two hydrogens, so that goes like that. You have two Cl's, which is what we wanted. And then you have two times four oxygens, which are now eight. So I'm going to get rid of that four, and I get an eight. But look at that. Two chlorines on both sides, eight oxygens on both sides, and two hydrogens. This is balanced. So this is my balanced equation. I have one Cl2O7 plus one H2O, which will come together and make two HClO4s. That's it, guys. Thank you so much for viewing this video. I really hope this helped. Let me know in the comments. And if you want to help us out, please press the subscribe button. I will see you all in later lessons. See you then. Bye-bye.